Demi Lovato and Max Eric are engaged. Singer Demi Lovato and actor Max Eric announced their engagement Wednesday. The singer and actress announced on Instagram Wednesday night that she has found a lifelong partner in actor Max Eric. When I was a little girl, my birth dad always called me his little partner something that might have sounded strange without his southern cowboy-like accent. To me it made perfect sense. And today that word makes perfect sense again but today I'm officially going to be someone else's partner, Lovato wrote as the caption for a series of photos. The images show Lovato and Eric embracing on a beach. She is wearing a large engagement ring on her finger. I'm honored to accept your hand in marriage, she wrote. I love you more than a caption can express but I'm ecstatic to start a family and life with you. On his own Instagram, Eric wrote to Lovato that he couldn't spend another second of my time here on earth without the miracle of having you as my wife. The engagement comes during a year when Lovato opened up about her conversation with her parents regarding her sexuality and the possibility that she could end up with a woman. It was actually, like, emotional but really beautiful, Lovato said in January. After everything was done, I was, like, shaking and crying, and I just felt overwhelmed. At the time she said she was still unsure what her future family would look like. I don't know what my future looks like, she continued. I don't know if I'm going to have kids this year or in 10 years. I don't know if I'm going to do it with a partner or without. Long open about her own mental health struggles, Lovato also spoke out in April about mental health during the COVID-19 pandemic. So many have been left alone with their thoughts, their anxieties, their abusers, and are struggling with the uncertainty of these times, Lovato wrote in the caption. That is why I am helping to launch hashtag the mental health fund to support organizations who are meeting the increased demand in crisis counseling due to COVID-19.